Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. Um, I know I'm pretty late on my CVS haul this week, but I feel like it's been a really busy week for me. First, let's just get started into the deals and what I got. Um, today, I just did mine and my husband's grandma's card. Let me walk you around the store and show you what I got. All right, so first things I'm picking up are the user and lotions. I'm gonna get this one at 11.49. And then I'm gonna pick up this one at 9.49 and the user and I spend 20 get a $10 extra buck. And then I'm gonna pair in this Vaseline lotion for 4.69. And then I'm only pairing this in so, um, cause my employee discount is gonna bring it lower than the CRT I have, which is a four off of 20. So I need this to make sure I'm still at $20. Next two things are gonna be the Nivea Men's Body Wash. I'm gonna get one of these rock salts one and the sensitive one. They are each $5.79, and then when you buy two, you get a $5 extra buck back. Now I'm gonna get two of these Olay Body Washes. They are two for 12, and when you buy two, you get a $5 extra buck. Next thing I'm getting is this Wet n Wild gift set. It is $9.99, and then it is on promotion for buy one at $9.99, get an $8 extra buck back. I'm also picking up two of these um, Hershey's Kisses. They are two for six, and when you buy two, you get a $2 extra buck back. And they have a whole bunch of different flavors. My family just likes milk chocolate the best. So I'm also picking up two of these Oral-B toothbrushes. They are $4.59, and then when you buy one, you get a $3 extra buck with a limit of two. So I'm going to be picking up two of these secret clinical strength uh, deodorants. They are $10.29, and then buy one, get one 50% off. And then I'm going to pick up these two. They are two for 10, and then the secret deodorant is buy four, get a $10 extra buck. So now I'm going to pick up these GSQ um, nail filers at $4.99, and then when you buy one, you get a $4 extra buck back. So the next deal I did is the Ubuy Kotex. I picked up two of these Ubuy Kotex light days at 169 they're buy one get one 50 percent off and when you buy two you get a two extra buck back and then i paired in the cvs panty liners at 129 for crt reasons now i'm gonna pick up three of these hallmark cards i'm gonna pick up two of them at 99 cents and then one of them at 299 only because my employee discount it's gonna bring it down so i'm gonna be picking up two of these joa cosmetics uh, makeup brushes this one is at $7.99 and this one is at $6.99 and then when you spend $15 you get a $10 extra buck back. So I also picked up the Ladies Crest toothpaste at $2.99. Alright, so I'm also picking up uh, one of these panty liners at $1.19 and then we get $1.19 back in extra bucks. I'm picking up one of these CVS, whatever that is, at $4.49 and then you get a $4.49 extra buck back. So then I'm going to pick up six of these pantines. They are three for $12. And they're part of the spend 30, you get a $10 extra buck. And instead of getting the two use rings, I'm gonna get this Aqua 4 at $20.49, and then the spend 20, you get a $10 extra buck. And then when I scanned it on Ibotta, it was attaching to two rebates, so hopefully I get them both. And then I'm picking up one of these CVS um, baby wipes at 99 cents, and then you get 99 cents and extra bucks back. So, first transaction I did was um, on my husband's grandma's card, and I got the Wet n Wild. One of the Wet n Wild gift sets for $9.99. I got the Gillette razors for $5.99. And I did grab two of the Hershey's Kisses, but my family already ate one bag. Saw so that my total came out to $21.88. Um, I had a $5 off of Gillette Razor CRT and then a $2 off of Gillette Razor CRT. So that made that completely free. I had that $2 off of two Hershey's Kisses instant coupon from last week okay that's why my math was so wrong when i was doing the math earlier so um at a three off of 15 cosmetic crt so i did grab a little wet and wild um beauty set but i have no idea where it's set so that's here too <laughs> or it should be here so yeah i got three dollars off of that all right so i redid my math because I forgot to add that little one. And my whole total for everything was $26.97 at a total of $10.99 in coupons. So I brought my total down to $15.98. But I got an $8 back for the Wet n Wild gift set. I got a $4 back for the little Wet n Wild gift set. And then I got $2 for buying two of the Hershey's Kisses and a $2 for the Gillette Razors, making that a total of $16 an extra buck, making 
all that free. Next transaction I did was on my card. I grabbed two of these clinical strengths deodorants and two of the um, regular ones, I guess. Uh, the regular ones were two for 10. The clinical strength was buy one, get one 50% off. And then it's when you buy four, you get a $10 extra buck back. I grabbed one of the Wet n Wild Beauty sets at $9.99, and when you buy one, you get an $8 extra buck back. I grabbed two of the You Buy Coat Techs, and then when you buy two, you get a $2 extra buck. I grabbed one of the CVS Panty Liners for uh, CRT reasons. I grabbed one of the GSQ um, Nail Files for $4.99, and then when you buy one, you get a $4 extra buck back. And three of the Hallmark cards, and then when you buy three, you get a $3 extra buck back. So here's my receipt. The two first things are the 2 for 10 secret deodorants, the GSQ nail files, the Wet n Wild gift set, the U by Kotex, and then the two secret deodorants for buy one get one 50% off. And then my three Hallmark cards and the CVS liners. My employee discount took off a dollar from non-CVS items and 39 cents from CVS items. So I had a five off a three secret digital manufacturing coupon, a four off a two secret clinical CRT, a four off a ten wet and wild, four off a three Hallmark cards that only took off three ninety seven because that's all that was left, and then I had a second four off a two secret clinical CRT, and then I had a three off a three tampons pads or liner CRT. I rolled over a total of, I'm assuming $24 in extra bucks. I really hope that $3.84 was a $4. I really don't remember because I did roll over more. But then I had to take something off because it wasn't working out. So then, um, and she couldn't go back to the coupon. So I just said, okay, we'll just leave it. And hopefully it's just a $4 one. And to be honest, I still don't know. I kind of have too many extra bucks for me to like notice i guess but but yeah either way i'm hoping it's a four dollar one i'm gonna say it's a four dollar one so i can make myself feel better so i rolled over a total of 24 dollars in extra bucks and i had to pay just taxes which was two dollars and 67 cents i had a total savings of 59 dollars and 78 cents with a hundred percent and I did get my $2 for the buying two of the U by Kotex, my $10 for purchasing four of the clinical or the secret deodorant, my $4 for the GSQ, my three for the Hallmark, and my eight for the Wet n Wild gift set. With rolling over those $24 in extra bucks and having to pay $2.62 67 out of pocket, that brought my total down or up to $26.67, but I got a total of $27 in extra bucks back, making everything free and a 33 cent money maker. Still on my card, I got six of the Pantene um, shampoos, two of the Crest toothpaste, and then one of the Oral B single toothbrushes. Those were $2.99. The Pantene was three for twelve. Um, and that was part of the spend 30, get a $10 extra buck back. I got two of the Oral B multi-pack or two-pack uh, toothbrushes for four fifty-nine, I believe and then when you buy one you get a three dollar extra buck back and then I grab the CVS I don't know what that is but like the pill thingy for four forty-nine. and then when you buy one you get a four forty-nine extra buck back and that was part of the Black Friday deals and then I also grabbed the CVS panty liners a 20 pack for a dollar nineteen, and then when you buy that, you get a dollar nineteen back, and that was also part of the Black Friday deals. So here's my receipt. You can see all the Pantene, the Crest toothpaste, the Oral B uh, single tooth toothbrush, sorry, and then the CVS panty liners, the CVS pain reliever, and then my two Oral B two pack toothbrushes. My employee discount took off $1.84. Rolled over a total of $18 in extra bucks. My subtotal was zero, so I just paid taxes, which was $3.33. And then for this transaction, I remembered I had a gift card. So um, that was a Swagbucks gift card. So I used that, so I didn't pay anything out of pocket. Uh, mm, so I had a total savings of 100% and $59.67. And I did get my $10 for spending 30. 
my I did get six dollars as you can see I offer limit reach for the two pack toothbrushes and then I got my $4.49 for the pain reliever and $1.19 for the liners. With rolling over those $18 in extra bucks and having to pay $3.33 out of pocket, it brought my total to $21.33. But in extra bucks, I got a total of $21.68 back, making all of this free and a 35 cent money. I got a couple on my card. I had to split it up because it wasn't working out when I tried to do it all together. So... Here's the next one. Um, I grabbed two of the Nivea Men's Body Wash. They were $5.79. You buy two, you get a $5 extra buck back. The Vaseline Lotion for $4.69. And then the Aquaphor Healing Ointment for $20.49. And then the Aquaphor was spend 20, get a $10 extra buck back. For the CVS Ultra Soft um, Cleansing Wipes for 99 cents. And when you buy one, you get 99 cents back in extra bucks. That was part of the Black Friday promotion. And then I grabbed two of the Joa Cosmetics uh, brushes. One was $7.99, the other was $6.99. And I believe it was spend 15, get a uh, $10 extra buck back. So here's my receipt, the CVS wipes, the Nivea body washes, the Joa cosmetic brushes, and the Aquaphor and Vaseline lotion. My employee discount took off $7.36 from non-CVS brand items, and then $4.50 from CVS brand um, items. I'm not sure what I'm, the only thing I can think of that it might have taken $4.50 with the Joa Cosmetics because the Nivea, the Vaseline, the Aquaphor are obviously not CVS or would be associated with CVS. And then the whites were just 99 cents, but they were on sale. So my employee discount wouldn't apply to that. Uh, I had two $1 manufacturing coupons for the Joa Cosmetics. They were Peely coupons that I got a while ago. Um, I had a $3 off two Nivea, Nivea uh, body washes uh, manufacturing coupon and a two dollar off of the aquaphor from coupons.com at a dollar fifty manufacturing digital coupon for the vaseline at a four off of 20 lotion crt and a two dollar off of the vaseline crt that only took off a dollar 67. Um, i rolled over a total of 26 dollars in extra bucks my subtotal was 70 cents, and then with taxes, I had to pay $3.93 at a total savings of 99% and $52.43. And then here you can see, I it does say I'm two cents short from the Joel Cosmetics, but my CVS does a 98% roll, so I did get that $10 extra buck. Um, I got 99 cents for the wipes, and then $5 for the Nivea body wash. I did not get my Aquaphor one, and I don't know why, because the tag was on it, but I didn't notice till I got home and looked at my receipt a little later, because um, I was in CVS for a while, so I really didn't want to sit there and look through my receipt, so I tried to hurry up and leave. But it had a tag in front of it and everything, so I'm hoping um, customer service can issue me that $10 extra buck. Never have any luck with them, so... <laughs> Um, we'll see how it goes. If I don't get that $10, I'm just going to return it, to be honest with you. So, hopefully they can give it to me. So, with the $26 and extra bucks I rolled over and the $3.93 I had to pay out of pocket, that brought my total to $29.93. With extra bucks, I got a total of $25.99 back, bringing my total to $3.94. But... Um, on Ibotta, there's a dollar rebate for the Nivea body washes, and I got, what's the limit of three, I believe? I got two, so I got two dollars back, and then the Aquaphor, um, it applied to two different rebates. Um, I really can't remember how much. I know one was like, uh, 80 cents, and the other one was like a dollar and 10 cents or something. I redeemed for all that, and then also when I submitted my receipt, um, there was a bonus for the Aquaphor for a dollar when you do two different um, rebates. And since I did two different ones, since that one applied to two different ones, I got an extra dollar back. So total um, rebates I got on Ibotta was 
five dollars and 35 cents that it made all of this free and a dollar 41 money maker that's supposed to me including that um ten dollar gift card or ten dollar uh what is it extra buck i'm hoping to get back for the aqua four so that ten dollars i'm hoping to get back it would make this a dollar and 41 money maker all right so last transaction i did on my card was the olay body wash they are two for 12 and when you buy two you get a five dollar extra buck back here is my receipt i had two one dollar manufacturing coupons from december png and then i had a two off of two olay body wash crt i rolled over seven dollars and extra bucks my subtotal was a dollar and then with taxes i had to pay two dollars and five cents i had a total savings of 93 percent and thirteen dollars and 58 cents then buy two get a five dollar extra buck so i did get that five dollars back rolling over those seven dollars and extra bucks and having to pay two dollars and five cents out of pocket it brought my total to nine dollars and five cents but i got that five dollar extra buck back making these four dollars and five cents or two dollars and like three cents each which i don't feel like is a bad deal i mean these are expensive so yeah and i don't get any body wash crt so i'm trying to build that up so i mean hopefully i get some we'll see so the last transaction i did was on my husband's grandma's card i got two of the paparazzis they were on sale for 99 cents no extra bucks back but they were on sale i grabbed two of the you buy cotex um and then when you buy two you get a two dollar extra buck back the cvs panty liners for a dollar 19 and then you get a dollar 19 back the cvs ultra soft um wipes for 99 cents and you get 99 cents back and then the cvs um pain reliever for 449 and then you get 449 and extra bucks back and all those cvs brand items were part of the black friday deal and then i grabbed three of the hallmark cards there is a kit kat king size because i did grab one but i already ate it <laughs> uh so i did grab that it was a dollar 88 and then when you buy one, you get a dollar extra buck back. The CVS panty liners, the CVS wipes, my two paparazzi nail polishes, the CVS pain reliever, the you buy Kotex, and my three Hallmark cards. I had a four off of three Hallmark card CRT that only took off $3.98 because that's all that was left. I had a three off of three feminine care CRT and two one dollar off of the paparazzis. The second one only took off 98 cents because that's all that was left. I rolled over an $8 extra buck. My subtotal was 8 cents. I paid with taxes 91 cents. I had a total savings of 100% and $23 and 2 cents. I got my $3 back for the Hallmark cards. $4.49 for the pain reliever. $1 for the Kit Kat. $0.99 cents for the wipes. $2 for the U by Kotex. And $1.19 for the uh cvs panty liners was rolling over those eight dollars and extra bucks and having to pay 91 cents out of pocket it brought my total to eight dollars and 91 cents um but i got a total of 12 dollars and 67 cents and extra bucks back making everything you see here free and a three dollar and 76 money maker all right so here's everything you got stacked up i'm sorry i couldn't make it look pretty it's super cold in the garage tonight and I'm tired so I want to hurry up and get this over with so again I'm sorry all the extra bucks I rolled over and everything I had to pay out of pocket it brought my total to $111.87 extra bucks and the rebates for my bottle it I got a total of $110.69 back making all 50 products $1.89 or just three cents each I'm pretty happy with that that went super awesome so um again i'm hoping that cbs will issue me that ten dollar extra buck for the aqua four but yeah still not a bad deal um like last week i think i'm gonna go back to get some um paper products since this was extremely cheap and again sorry it's a late post like i said i felt like i've been super busy um they've been giving me more hours at work i usually only work like four hour shifts and I only work like maybe four days out of the week. And I've been working eight hour shifts and like five days out of the week. 
so yeah it's a it's a big jump for me um i've never really worked eight hours um i would do it like once in a while here and there but never for like almost a whole two weeks straight so yeah i'm pretty tired and then also i gotta come home and um obviously watch my baby she's my baby but thank god for my mom and my husband they help out a lot so it's not too bad but like i said i'm just not used to working so much so it's pretty new to me <laughs> i know i sound like a big crybaby because almost everybody does it but anyways um thank you guys for watching i hope this can help you guys out if you guys have any deals left um, I did want to mention if you guys didn't do the U by Kotex deal this week yet and you still have your 3 off of 3 uh, CRT paired in with the CVS panty liners that's a freebie because then um, that would just be a bigger money maker for you guys. I didn't, I didn't really think about it when I was when I was getting them on my card so um, it is what it is. Super happy with this uh, transaction or this trip. I can't wait to go back and get some paper products for pretty cheap anyways guys thank you guys for watching i hope you guys have a good rest of your week and i'll see you guys in the next one have a good night bye